Thank you. And this is Andrew. Andrew. Thank you, Andrew. Uh, recommendations. There isn't a bad thing on the menu. Caesar salad's made right in the dining room from scratch. Yep. OK, good. Nice. There is great potential here. We just need someone like Gordon Ramsay to come in, because the relationship between Frank and Anthony is kind of sabotaging the restaurant. All the pasta's handmade. That's a big positive. All the pasta's handmade. Yeah, all okay. handmade. That's incredible. Let's start off with Il Valentini Melanese di Melanzani. Yeah. Sure. Got to go for the Caesar salad table side. Love that idea. And the fresh lobster ravioli. All right. The rack of lamb. I'll go for that as well. I want to see as much as I can and travel across Italy. Yeah? Brilliant. Yep. I hope so. Mm -hmm. How's the food? I think we can cut. Trying to push it out when the attitude's there, when he wants to. Uh -huh. How old's Frank? 47. 47. He looks older than that. Stress. Jeez. What's he having? Just off the involtini. Don't talk to me, just write it now. All right. I don't like talking to nobody. I'm nervous, but like at the same time, it's like, come on, bring the test on. I know I can pass it. I'm not blowing my own smoke on my ass, but that food is good. Prepare the Caesar. Anybody got the Caesar going? Brilliant. Table side Caesar in the north end of Boston, right? Yep. Are you going right to the very basics? You got an egg yolk there as well? Egg yolk. Yeah. Garlic, anchovies. Wow. Who would ever thought I'd be making a Caesar for Gordon Ramsay? I love doing the Caesar salad, so I put a lot of enthusiasm into it. Mm -hmm. Is that the Caesar? OK, great. Thank you. Very good. Have you just washed that salad? Yes. You just washed it then? Yep. Because it's soaking wet. So all the dressings just run off it because the lettuce is soaking wet. To dress a Caesar salad, the salad has to be crisp but dry. So you've made all that freaking work for nothing. Oh, my god. Eight minutes for nothing. Kim, you think he's going to like the food? I think so. Frank is so defeated right now that he's lost the confidence in himself as a chef and in his abilities. The eggplant is in the window. Want to get out, Andrew? The addiction, what was it? Painkillers. Painkillers? Yeah. I see it's heroin. Heroin. Really never been in trouble with the law before that. No. And, you know, no. First time, happened to be the Fed. And how long do you spend inside? Uh, almost four years. And you've been clean for how long now? Almost two years. That's fantastic. Yeah. Two years clean. Brilliant. Yeah, it's nice. Here we have the eggplant, the Votini di Molanzane. Thank you. Strange. Mm hmm. It's a bit soggy. Hasn't been fried or cooked long enough. No. Yeah. It's really spongy and horrible. Are they frozen? No, no, that's fresh. When were they done? This morning. Really? Will you just check if that was done this morning? Because it tastes like it was done last sure. week. What's up, Frank? Thank you. Frank, what? You said this was spongy? What was? When were they cooked? When were they made? Uh. He asked me if they were frozen. I said, no, they're not. Three weeks ago. Yeah, there's a batch of freezer. They don't make them too hard every day. I got to tell him. I can't make eggplant too hard. That's impossible. I don't have time. You got to say what they are, what they think. Unless he has a new method I don't know about. His method's going to be going to get here at 11 in the morning. <laughs> That's what the method is, Frank. Well, it's impossible to be here at 11 in the morning. No, it's not, Frank. Frank is a very lazy cook. He doesn't even fry the eggplant anymore. My mother and father end up frying it. Ridiculous. An um, eggplant made yesterday? It was actually made three weeks ago. Yep. Three weeks ago? Yep. That's disgusting. Do you go grocery shopping three weeks in advance before you're going to eat the, the stuff? No. Frank is a very lazy cook. He doesn't even fry the eggplant anymore. My mother and father end up frying it. 